Julius, just to carry on from that conversation, what has it meant as a team to see what he's uh, done for someone who's important to him and, and kind of how have you all rallied around him as he's had some, some stuff going on? Yeah, um, I mean, that kind of just shows you what kind of person Boots is, uh, honestly. And uh, I was, it was funny because I was going to get my haircut and I saw, I didn't even recognize him in the chair because he had said he was getting a haircut, but I didn't know it was going to be that. And when he had told me about it, I was like, wow, like, you know, like, uh, I don't know if I could have done that as far as like just at a spur of the moment, like cut my hair because uh, it's just what it means to, you know, rock a certain style or have your hair a certain way. It kind of like defines you as a person. And for him to do that, just uh, to show someone, hey, look, I'm in it with you. I'm going to be supporting you. Uh, you know, that showed me like what kind of person he really is. So. Julissa, uh, I guess just looking ahead to Florida, um, how much, you know, I know you, y'all didn't face them that long ago, uh, but they looked, how and what, it, whatever way do they look different now than they did going into that? Uh, yeah, no, they're a little bit different now. They've been, um, they had a couple of different guys play more minutes and they had different rotations now and they've been three and those since we played them, uh, played some pretty tough, good games. And uh, I mean, you know, we're going to, you know, uh, prepare for them like we did last time, uh, just making sure that we execute it. And I know they're not going to, you know, guard us the same way or run the same play. So we're just going to make sure that we're prepared for any, any and everything that they will throw at us. What's been the key personally for, for your success lately? What, what have you been doing differently? Um, I mean, I've been, I don't think I've done anything differently overall. I probably uh, keyed in a little bit, focused a little bit more uh, on certain things I need to do better. Like early in the season, I didn't rebound as well. And I've been rebounding a little bit better besides the last game. <laughs> where I didn't get any, but we'll talk about that later. But uh, yeah. it's just uh, just making sure that I, I stay consistent every day and making sure that, uh, you know, I contribute and get 1% one, 1 better is what, you know, Buzz and everybody else says, you know, get better each day. And just make sure I'm getting better as a person and as a player. And I think that's what's been attributed to my success as of late. Were able to somewhat neutralize Castro in the, in the first game. Oh, you repeat that? Y'all were able to somewhat neutralize okay. Colin Castleton in the first game. I know a lot of that was because of your work. Um, how do you do it again? Uh, well, we watched the film and we see uh, we've seen certain areas where he gets the ball and likes uh, being comfortable at. Just making sure that we know, <clears throat> uh, like, you know his moves in a certain way. Like when he gets on the block, what, what is he going to do? Is he going to go left side? Is he going to go baseline? Is he going to try and face you up? Uh, just making sure you get those reps, seeing all of that, and you know, having our practice guys kind of demonstrate that has helped a lot. And you can see that in certain. Uh, players that we played and you know we have like shut them down a little bit and that's what helped the first time because uh, uh, JV kind of gave us like almost like the perfect scout with him the first time on how he played and it kind of helped out when we regard him so just making sure that we do the same things again uh, as far as not letting him get comfortable uh, making it real tough for him. Is that enough? You guys got what you need from him? Okay. Thank you. Just